The Apex Predator has arrived. One of the all-time greats has seen and done everything there is to do in this business. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 275 pounds. The Viper, Randy Water in his veins and death in his eyes. Randy Orton has left a trail of fallen that has spanned over two decades. And there are very few champions in this game who are more decorated than the Apex Predator. And we also know that when Randy Orton goes to that place, it's over. A competitor who knows what he's doing at all times. That's why there's only one Apex Predator, and his name is Randy Orton. Well, Randy Orton has made a career out of psychologically dissecting his opponents. And many of the victims who have fallen for the Viper's schemes stayed out for good. Always composed, always in control. No one is more calculated. Once legend killer, now possibly the greatest legend in WWE history. Superstar, in my opinion. He rubs a lot of people the wrong way, but I find the honesty refreshing. He's in it for himself, for the riches, for the spotlight. It won't get you a lot of love on social media, but the checks will cash, and to him, that's all that matters. Well, refreshing is one word for it. Nevertheless, we'll see if the so called Grayson Waller effect takes hold tonight. And across the liftoff. He paid for that one. Oh, man, big time. Fishing for something beneath the ring. Oh, man, he grabbed the kendo stick. Everyone needs to watch out now. Neckbreaker! That's one of the hardest hits Waller has taken thus far. Orton looked confident in that exchange. And a big-time knee drop. That's how you wear down your opponent. Crank in the head. They are fading off the WWE fans, now pinning the arm down and delivering nasty stumps. And if the first stop doesn't send you the message, the follow-up ones definitely will. To stomp in every single part of his body. Corey Grayson Waller is relatively inexperienced and has to put the odds against him tonight, doesn't it? Not at all, Cole. While Waller's just getting started here, we've already seen how innovative he can be. I think if Waller relies on that snow way, the dive! that is reckless abandon being shown and paying off as well. Landing on top of the skull. Implanted by the DDT. Oh, stop, stop, stop. Followed by a forearm smash. 
Grayson now has a leg up in this match. Got off guard by Waller, who's using innovative offense to great effect. Grayson Waller is fired up and ready to go. He is looking to do some serious harm. He's been placed in the corner now. Close line in the corner. He's starting to struggle here. That's just Orton doing what he does best and letting him know he's not going anywhere. And shoulders are down. The pin doesn't even last to a count of one. He's nowhere near ready to stop fighting yet. Randy Orton. Nice backbreaker delivered by Orton. Oh, stop right to the hand. Oh, man, that's like death by a thousand cuts. Set up for the oh. leg sweep. Nicely done. Counter by Grayson. Oh, God, I'll rearrange your skull. Elbow drop with authority. side of an elbow. And he just showed Orton no fear with an assault like that. Does the official not see him removing the turnbuckle pad? Keep your voice down. Oh, an overhand punch. Thunderous club comes down. Very effective. And he's already taken more hits up there than he should have to handle. Scary pattern starting to form as that upper area takes more damage. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Grayson a step ahead there. Rolling Thunder into the flatliner. Set up for the side rushing leg sweep. He's got him down. Is this it? Turn around, ref. The action's behind you. And easily kicks out of the count. Gonna take a lot more than that to keep this man down. Big plans in mind for the Viper. He is looking to do some serious harm. Heads out of the ring, but needs to be mindful of the referee's count here. Back drop suplex. They are fading off the WWE fans, now pinning the arm down. And a series of vicious stomps. Each of those boots seem to get heavier with each blow. And gets tossed back into the mat. Down the opponent and a double axe handle smash. Continuing to dissect the leg of his opponent. Oof. Uh oh. With the reversal. Getting set up for something in the corner. Face first in the turnbuckle. Face first into the turnbuckle. And a vicious kick to the arm. Into the ring now. Caught with the lariat. And he's out of there in a nick of time. He heads outside. Countout's legal in this match. Harlem side kick. Oh my goodness, dribbling the opponent. 
his head like a basketball. And he's been concentrated on that area throughout this one. He knows every blow there weakens his opposition more each time. Vintage Orton! And Orton proved he's as lethal as ever with that attack. The Viper had his eyes on the prize, and he struck when the time was right. Of course things ended his way.